I think Tilikum is the loneliest whale in the world. We got to the park as soon as it opened. We went to the first Shamu uh, Believe show. A major difference between the show before and the show now is that Tilikum isn't part of it. They are keeping him entirely out of the show, I'm assuming for the safety of the trainers. It was very difficult to see him in the tank he was in, which is in the back, even though almost the entire tank was visible to us because he wasn't moving. He was staying in one spot almost the entire time. And even when he was moving, it was very slowly. He was barely coming to the surface to take breaths. I mean, we never saw a blow. These are very intelligent animals. They recognize individual people. They know the music. Oh, the show's coming on. They're very intelligent animals. And I know Tilikum knows something's wrong. Something's different. Something's not right. And I imagine he feels he's being punished and he probably has no idea why. The very foundation of captivity is the trainers become the whale's social partners. It's completely artificial. I don't agree with it, but that's the way it is. The training with the other whales, other than not getting into the water with them, is the same. They get a lot of physical contact from their trainers, lots of pets, lots of rub downs, lots of scratches. All of that is still the same. We did observe in between two shows, they were doing a massage session with him with the fire hose, which apparently is something they're, they're doing so that nobody touches him because he's, he's just too dangerous to get that close to. So we did see him being handled, but it was from six feet back. And it was again, very, very different than what he's used to. So again, he must know something's wrong. He must know something's not right. It's all so very different. It is the best they can do. I'm not saying it wasn't clever of them to come up with that idea, but it is not enough. They can't expect that to suffice for the rest of this whale's life. If he's depressed, it's as bad for whales as it is for people. It's affecting his health, I guarantee it. Tilikum is not being touched or interacting directly with his trainers anymore. I worry about him a lot, I really do. He's got to be the loneliest whale in the world.